Hello guys, welcome back to our channel, Experiments and Projects. Today we are going to make a home automation project using GSM and NIDA module. So let's get into the project. And here we go, you can see this. There are some jumper words, some male jumper words, and also some female jumper words. Okay, these are the male jumper words. And here are some LEDs. I'll keep this set and this is the breadboard and this is Arduino Nano and this is the GSM 900A module and here is the SIM card slot we will just open the SIM card slot and place the SIM card ok I am placing the SIM card and close the slot Okay. and this is the 12 volts adapter and place this Arduino in the breadboard place it properly make sure that the pins are and now we are going to place the LEDs the long one is the positive terminal and the short one is the negative terminal place this negative terminal in the down side and positive terminal in the upper side then we can easily connect the ground pin to the negative terminal So this small one has a small pins. I am connecting it separately. Okay, we are going to make the connection. We can make this connection with any pin in the Arduino Nano. Like D2, D4, D6, D10, D11, any pin. And this pins to the positive terminal ok I am connecting this install this algorithm D11 to the last place it properly in the last pin this is the ground pin we will connect this ground pin in the Arduino Nano GND to the negative pin in the LEDs I will make this in common to all the LEDs and this LED is separately I make the pin common because it has a short pins ok the LED wiring is done Now we are going to cut the GSM pin to the Arduino so that we have to give the power supply from GSM SIM to Arduino module so that uh, we have to cut the VCC pin okay GNT pin from GSM to Arduino Nano and VCC pin from GSM to Arduino Nano 5 volt pin so that the pod Arduino Nano can switch on ok power supply is done and now 
the transmission and receive pins TX and RX pins so that the TX and RX pins from GSM module to Arduino pin is oppositely connected it's like TX pin from GSM module to Arduino RX pin and the RX pin from the GSM module to Arduino TX pin okay connect properly and correctly Connections are done. Now we have to give the power supply to the JSON module. I'm going to give the power supply. Okay, the JSON is powered on. Now we have to dump the program into the Arduino Nano board. So that we need a computer for this. Don't worry, I'll provide the program in the description. So now we have to change the phone number in this program so that we have to swipe down, swipe down. Okay. Yes, here we go. Here we replace this with our phone number. And the uh, 91 is the country code. I have to replace this country code with 91 also. So that that's it, guys. Program is done. So that we need to connect the audio number with our computer. So that we have to select the board type. So here we can select the board type. Audio nano. So here we go. From here we have to set the port also. The port is not connected to the computer so that the port is not showing. So I will connect the port with the computer. Then here we go the port is also showing so select the port and press the ok button that's it plug next compile ok compilation is done just now just list up the program that's it guys the program is dumped successfully and here is the circuit diagram so now we will test the circuit so guys don't make mistakes here I will make a mistake so that I am correcting it so now the connections are ok and then I will type the message device 5 So boom guys, the weight is switched off. So this circuit is working. Whenever we will set the text messages to the respected number, the GSM module will collect the message and send the signals to the Arduino board. Then the pulses make the lights switching off. So here we can see this, all the LEDs are switching on, so that we will switch off this LEDs too. Okay. 
by sending the text messages. We may switch on and switch off these LEDs and we can control the home appliances as like this guys by placing the relay modules. That's it guys. If you got any doubt, please ping me in the comment box. I'll give you a reply to every comment and I will help you to make this project. Thank you. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe guys. Thank you for watching.